out there and welcome to English Teacher Plays. We're here, here with Logicality, which is a new game. It's on Steam. And full disclosure, I did receive my copy of the game for free. Um, Hold up. Game for free. Um, and this is a very nice little start here. I would suggest... Uh, when you're going to be recording ambient sound at the beach that you use a dead cat on the mic um, because when the wind blows into the mic you can hear that sound and it's not a great sound um that's just a suggestion for next time uh but we're gonna we're gonna jump in now i don't know anything about this it does kind of look like witness yeah there's that blowing into the mic thing is uh it's not good not good I don't, i'm not a fan of that but that's okay not everybody uh, is perfect with their recording, especially ambient sound. I've seen lots of uh, videos and movies and stuff where people have not done their thing. Oh, one one other thing. I forgot to mention this before. Uh, so, uh, I write. I'm a writer. I write things. I like to write. Um, and I've recently had my first short story published in this book called Aftermath, Stories of Survival in Aotearoa, New Zealand. Um, I'm in there as, uh, C.D. Jacobs, and my story is called 34 Days, so if you're interested, it's available on Amazon, uh, there's an e-book e version of it, I'll, I'll put it up, I'll put a link to it on the, uh, in the description here so you can see, um, I mean, uh, you know, obviously the, the intersection between people who read short stories and people who play, play games is not a, a, a zero, Venn diagram, but it's not necessarily a, a massively overlapping one. So uh, don't feel obligated, obviously, but if you are interested, I will put the link there. So I guess we're playing. Okay. One. Okay, so we solved the puzzle. Oh, here's another puzzle. Uh, this one's four, three, two, one, right? Nice. I don't know what the crying baby thing is. So it is, it's very, very, very similar to Witness, isn't it? So that's... Three... One... Four... Two... I am a genius, my friends. All right, what's this one? Uh, that one's also a four, I think. One. Yep. Yeah. Uh, oh. Okay. There was no baby crying that time. Ooh, we'll follow. We'll follow. We're solving some puzzles in logicality. Oh, okay, and we can't that we do have a little bit of a jump, but not a big one All right, so here's where our next next puzzle lies, okay So what do we What are we up to? What's the what's the dealio? Do we need to do we need to power more things I think we need to power more things Okay, let's go do that then uh, it's that one. Let's follow that back to where it's where it's leading. So there's like there's power lines. That's pretty cool. So you solve puzzles to power the. Th Wait, did I lose the thing? No, there it is. Okay. Oh wow, it's all the way over here. That's all right. We're gonna go solve this puzzle. Um, alright, so it's another one of these things. We just gotta find the... We gotta find the first one, yeah? Oop. Okay. Oop. I can't get in there. Why can't I... Why can't I go in there? I have to go in through the gate? No, that's wrong. Okay. So... What are we... What are we doing? Hmm... All right, let's let's go to one that we can actually get into. Oh, we can't get into that one either. So the trick the trick that I'm missing here is we've got to find the start. We got to find the first one of these because you can't get into them. 
unless you're supposed to. Is it this one? So we can do this one. But I don't, I don't really get it. Um, there's this thing up here, so we can, so we can look down on it. Okay. So this is the start. All right. I don't. I mean, there's only going to be one sequence that works, right? But so there's only there's 16 different sequences. Okay. I'm going to brute force this. For nice. I definitely did not solve that. I brute forced it. Um, so we're going to... I don't, I don't know what happened there. What, so what did we, what did we even solve? What did we, oh, the, the light didn't come on. All we did was turn that on. Okay. So that didn't open up any doors or anything. Right. Can we, can we click buttons from this side? Oh, we can. Oh, but we can't, but we can't get around the other side. Okay. All right. Well, um, oh, here we go. Fine. Okay. We found the start of it. Right. Now I see, now I see what the doors are for. And that, that I thought it was a crying baby. It's not, it's a gate opening. Oof, this is difficult to get around. Uh, okay. Sorry, which one? Oh, I don't even, I don't, I should have paid attention, man. I was not paying attention. What was the order? It goes one, two, three, four. So left, down. All right, so we go four. Um... Two? Uh, three? No. Okay, let's try it again. Let's go four. One. Nope. I'm sure it's four first. Oh, no, I see. It's the opposite way. Okay, so the big one's the one. All right, one. Uh, oh, my God. One, four. Um, nope. What's the, what's the order here? One, three, two. All right, we got it. We solved it. All right. Okay, so it's not four, three, two, one. It's so it's three first. Oh no, it's not. All right. We'll just press. We'll press them all anyway. And okay. Uh, I was just, I was just running through that to get it out of the way. <laughs> Oh, fail. Okay. I don't... I don't... I don't know. Nope. Alright, so what is that? I don't know what that symbol means. I don't... I don't understand the symbol. Um... I don't know. I don't know. We're going to brute force it.
Okay, so I haven't actually been figuring these puzzles out. I've just been brute forcing them. Um, that one was the one that took the longest so far. Uh, this is my little note here. You can see what I was doing. I was, I was brute forcing the, the thing. And I think I know what it means now. One, four, two, three is what the solution is. If that's one or whatever. I don't know. Maybe I'm supposed to go... No. No, I still don't. I still don't know. Maybe it's a normal one, then you rotate 90, then a normal one, then you rotate 90 again. I don't know. I Because there's only four buttons, yeah. Um, it means that there's a, a limited amount of potential outcomes so you don't actually have to solve the puzzles uh you can brute force them there's potentially what is that there are six different um there are six different uh codes for each starting point so if you can figure out what the first one is then you only have to go through six Variation, but that's that's if you can figure out what the first one is then you only have to go through six But if you don't figure out what the first one is then the most combinations that you should have to go through is 24 To, to actually get the answer So yeah, I mean that's a That's a thing I'm not saying that's a problem. It means that I'm not getting stuck when I probably should be getting stuck um, It's you know, okay, so we've got a So we're trying to get up this tower, I guess um, yeah, so I guess we just go to any, any of these puzzles, we'll see what the next puzzles look like, so it is very much like Witnesses, but it's got the same soundtrack that's looping over and over, um, wait, where did my thingy go, oh, it's in here, okay, here we go, here's the first one, right, so we're gonna go in a circle, I guess, right, so this, we're going, this one we're going the other way. Nope, it wants us to start here. Yep. Alright, and I guess we're supposed to be learning how the puzzles go as we go. 9, 3, 12, 16. Okay. Sure. Uh, so nine would be three, I guess, and then one. Oh, that's four. I'm gonna get this wrong. All right, so three, one, four, two. Yep, got me stumped. Okay, well, as you can see, we can just, like I said, we can just brute force stuff if we need to. Um, oh, it's where they are on the clock, maybe? So, 9, 3, 12, 6. So, it goes 9, like that? No. Hey, it was a clock. Okay. 30, 45, 15, 0. Right, so 30... 45, 15, 0. Right, well, we're solving these much faster um, than the first ones. We're not having to brute force a lot of these, which is good. 12, 15, 45, 6. Right. 12, 15, 45. Yeah, so that's good. We're not we're not having to brute force stuff. We're, we're, we're solving things, which is good. 3, 9, 6, 12, going to the left. Uh... Okay. I don't I don't know what that means though. Three nine six twelve? That'll be wrong. Okay, well let's go look at the description and see what the game has to say for itself. Um it is very witness like. Alright, logicality. Immerse yourself in an exciting journey on the island of dreams. Explore the open world and interesting places while solving various puzzles that use environment. Okay. Um, it currently costs $7.71. That's a good price for it. Uh, visit different locations on the island, each with its own visual style and its own type of puzzle, but all of them united by one easy-to-understand mechanics. Immerse yourself into the island's atmosphere while watching beautiful sceneries, listening to ambient sounds, and relaxing music. Yeah, 
it needs more different ambient sounds and relaxing music because I could definitely hear it looping. Um, and if I'm going to be playing the game for a long time, which I would be, um, you really do need more music, yeah? 70 different puzzles built on a common principle, but each one unique in its own way, becoming gradually more complex in a new part of the island. Beautiful landscapes, interesting locations that are pleasant to walk around while exploring the surrounding areas, enjoying relaxing atmosphere created by a combination of visual effects, sound, music, and different environments designed in a unique style, Japanese garden, castle, canyon, etc. Solve special increased difficulty puzzles to uncover all the island's secrets. All right, not bad if you enjoyed The Witness, bit lower budget, but worth a go. Yeah, so it is, yeah, it is. It, people are like, yep, yeah, it's just like The Witness. I enjoyed my two hour 100% of the game. Yeah, it's, it's not bad. It's pretty good. For seven bucks, it's really good, I'd say. Um, and if you're looking for Witness, but more, uh, then yeah, get into it. Like I said, one of the, one of the downfalls of this puzzle variety is that there's only 24 possible solutions, which means that without engaging with the puzzle mechanics at all, I can solve all of the puzzles with a maximum of 24 varieties, plus maybe five or six, because I forget to do one. Yeah, so that's the only issue that I see with it. Um, so here's this developer's other games, Pandora's Room, Door, Two, Key. So they've got a few, looks like they've got a few of these styles of game um, that they've released over the last couple of years. Uh, this is their first game in 2022, though, so hopefully they've, they've spent a bit more time on it. Yeah, it's it's not bad, guys. It's pretty good. If you like The Witness, you'll like this. Uh, if you didn't like The Witness, this might actually suit you better because the puzzles are going to be easier because, like I said, you can brute force your way through them. So, yeah, that's all I'm going to say about it. It's pretty good. It looks good. I wish there was more different kinds of music and maybe some more variety in the puzzles. But for what it is, it's good. It's good. So I'm going to leave it there. Thanks for watching. Like and subscribe. Leave me a comment down below. Um, if you like the video, then like the video and subscribe to the channel and stick around afterwards and click on the playlist at the end and see more games like this. Otherwise, I'll see you guys next time. Class dismissed.